What is good, A Team? It's your boy A T. Now, hey, bro, we just dropped a video off yesterday for the Chiefs fans' reactions to the Super to Super Bowl Fifty Five. You feel me? If y'all haven't seen that, I'll drop a link up there. Y'all definitely be sure to go check that out. Y'all been showing love on that. I think it's almost at like three K views right now. Um, so y'all definitely going crazy on that. Appreciate all the love on it. But I told y'all we was gonna come with. A reaction to the Super Bowl commercials because I was live streaming during the Super Bowl, but I didn't really get to see. I think I only seen like two or three of the commercials in like full length. I saw the Drake commercial, but that was like the second time it came on at the end of the 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 uh, game, if I'm not mistaken. So I seen that one, and then it was one with uh, Michael B. Jordan where I like I saw it, but I didn't really get to hear all of it. You feel me? But that one seemed like it was kind of funny as well. But either way, bro. As y'all see from the title, all the funniest Super Bowl commercials of 2021 extended. Let's go crazy. Like I said, I I would say I've only seen two, basically. You feel me? And not even in full length, so. When did Bud Light Seltzer start making lemonade? Probably when 2020 handed us all those lemons. 2020 was a lemon of a year. Why not the same guy? January, February, into March and April. Same way. Every single second, every minute, every hour. All the whole year through. Damn, I'm you're done for. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. There's a lot of lemons. Well, you know what they say when life gives you we lemons. We know the saying, Mark. New Bud Light Seltzer Lemonade. Pack I ain't gonna lie, those look like they they might hit, but what's the purpose? 5% alcohol? With lemonade flavor after a lemon of a year. I You're watching lemonade, Jake that. Softin, and these are That one really wasn't that that good, though, if I'm being All honest. the funniest Super Bowl commercials from 2021. This video was created for educational purposes as a historical archive so people from the future can see what... Nigga, play the video. Advertising was like in the year 2021. I feel bad for kicking your seat on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak. This one might be funny. That boy said, I'm feel bad for kicking your seat year on purpose. 2021. Damn. I feel bad for kicking your seat on purpose. First of all, what the hell is this nigga drinking? Is that tomato soup? Like you got tomato soup on the, you know what? I'm sorry for mansplaining. That's when a man. I know what it is. We should have just told you it's a boy. <laughs> oh, I wish you didn't have to hear all that. I'm sorry for mansplaining. That's when a man. I know what it is. We should. A man. What? what? I feel bad for kicking your seat on purpose. I'm sorry for mansplaining. That's when a man. I know what it is. I don't is. know what he's talking about. We should have just told you it's a boy. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you didn't have to hear all that. Sorry, I called you Karen. That's my name. Sorry, your name is Karen. I promise I will not eat. I'm weak. That's kind of funny. That's like the whole Karen, uh, like courtside Karen and all that. You feel me from the Lakers and Hawks? Any more of your funny. friends? Really? Okay, it might happen one more time. Did you steal my Cheetos again? This Cheetos one is going viral on TikTok. Just tell him it wasn't you. But I caught you at the counter. It wasn't me. Saw you snacking on the sofa. It wasn't me. What? You even had him in the shower. Bro, what is her name? I've seen her in a few movies, if I'm not mistaken. Of course, that's Ashton. Ashton could. It wasn't me. Yeah. I even caught you on camera. To your I actually did see a piece of this. This one was actually kind of dope that they had Shaggy in there. You feel me? Talk surprised that you sleep behind your back. You gotta keep tabs before uh, she emptied up back. Let's review the situation. Orange fingers, red flag. To keep you on stuff, <laughs> you gotta hide it better. If she asks where they are, you say forget her. Never admit to a word. And please don't upset her. And if she keep on snacking, I guess you will let her. Well, did you? Wasn't me. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, that's the first time that's ever worked. 
<laughs> he talking about in his song, nigga. I ain't, hey, it wasn't, it wasn't that easy, crutch pop mix. It was not that easy. Where is everyone? Pringles original. Barbecue. Pizza. The barbecue pizza stack. Look, we're saved. Hey. We're going home. <laughs> let me guess, they got. Uh, yeah, let me guess. Crunch! They can't even go stack them! I have this many Pringles on Endless flavors to stack. Enjoy carefully. That was an okay one. I don't know. Where's the Bud Light? It's missing. What a mess. This is like, um... Avengers Endgame. Post Malone? Cedric, medieval people, Johnny, Dr. Galagos? Yes, I am. Still got those moves. Post Malone, I ain't seen this man in a, in, a, in, a, in a little minute. Last time I seen him, he was bald, though. So I'm guessing he's growing his hair back out. Of course, we got Cedric the Entertainer. That uh, jacket, though, that Post Malone got on is kind of tough, bro. You know it. All right, Bud Light legends. Let's do this. That's Bud Light. Bud Light. <laughs> My bad. A singer, real man of genius singer. That's kind of all I do. Keep it going, guys. Keep it going. I'm going up. Dilly, dilly! High five! You got it. Oh! Dang. <laughs> oh, we. Yeah, he's not gonna make it. I loved you, man. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, the Bud Light's back. Nice. The Bud Light legend saved the day. Yeah, that one had a couple funny parts. Party's but it still in my portal. Still wasn't too, too crazy, you feel me? Superstars. Who knows what goes through their minds when the stakes are this high? When their legacy on the line sometimes you just want a hard seltzer a hard seltzer with no carbs with no sugar i'm looking like is that i thought that was serena williams and i thought it was usher these are <laughs> that's supposed to be sylvester stallone y'all got all these <laughs> all those people are a-list people y'all have d-list people uh stepping in for parties, parties in for my them. portal on. These are dollar. These are dollar general superstars. <laughs> Who knows what goes through their minds when the stakes That's are this to be high? Bad bunny out there. When their legacy is on the line. Sometimes you just want a hard seltzer. A hard seltzer with no cup. It's not us. Like no sugar. Because who needs that? I want a hard seltzer. That's USDA certified organic. With no artificial aftertaste. I don't know but who that's supposed to be. In a world where most things seem real. Hold on. Sometimes then. Okay, I was about to say, I'm like, okay, so he's in here. I know he's real. I've seen him before. I can't think of his name for some reason. But old boy next to him, say goodbye. That's the Nine. <laughs> I ain't even Don Cheadle. Man, get off the boat. Don Cheadle. That's fair. New Michelob Ultra Organic Seltzer is real. And it tastes that way. You're not real. You almost fooled me. Lookalikes. Phony. New Michelob Ultra Organic Seltzer. As real as it tastes. That one might have been one of the better ones so far. Christopher Walken. Here in the Romo household, we take things to the max. This is a foolish commercial. They got all this, like... Honey, get my stretch pants. Oh, yeah. I've seen this one, too. Honey, you still in bed? Yeah. Bam. Bring on the traffic. Bye! 
Tony Romo. Tony. That's you, why what? That bitch say Tony back? Romo. Yep. Yeah. Tony Romo. Romo. <laughs> Get on the trap. Bye. Oh yeah. That's why we love Skechers Max Cushioning Footwear. They've maxed out the cushion for extreme comfort. Bam! It's like working on clouds. Big comfy ones. Try Skechers Max Cushioning for yourself. Oh yeah. That actually do look comfortable, but are you really wearing them? And that's just what they'll do. That's right. One of these oh, this days old girl, she actually does the voiceovers on Good Morning. Mm -hmm. That's a mighty fine pair of boots. Yeah, this lady is hilarious, bruh. She's been in a couple comedy movies that I've seen, and she does the voiceover for one of the, what is it? The um, the gender monster? I can't remember what it's called, but she does a voiceover for the one of the female monsters on Big Mouth. You feel me? Let's get them boots. I'll make payment one, two, three. I'll make payment four. <laughs> really? Bro, everybody's offering uh, that, the man. Backyard. Pay it's had quite all a year. Long. I say, let's keep this backyard thing going. That's why Scott's and miracle Grow want to give you a chance to win the lawn and garden of your dreams. Like mine. You know, just not better than mine. Like mine, where you can work on your short game. My boy from the office, Stanley, was father. That's funny. Like mine. Oh, it's a little close. Oh. It only turns left. Come on, Leslie, <laughs> crush your core. I don't crush you, Emma. Dad, it's the red one. I know. The other red one. I know. Feeling good. Like I said. Why well, can't I think of his name, bro? Swordfish. I know his. Hold on, bro. I'm about to find this real quick. I know this man. He is a known actor for sure. I know I spelled it wrong, but I don't care. Look at this. <laughs> Tag is his name, bro. Is it that hard to find? John Travolta. All right, we back to it. John Travolta. I cannot think of his name. We still got it. So text me now and win the lawn and garden of your dreams. Hey, Travoltas, don't be tickety talking on my grass. <laughs> what if this could change the world? A burrito. Yeah. You are so weird. It could. It could change how we plant things, water things, grow things, pick things, move things, and transportation things. What? That's not a thing. It could make our farmers happier, more organic, more real, more soil helping, less carbon emitting, and world changing. Hey, are you still talking? That's a Chipotle commercial? Why is this titled all the funniest Super Bowl commercials of 2021? How is that funny? Bronk. This one, I did see this one though. I seen this one on uh, YouTube yesterday. What do you think my next move should be? Give it to me straight. This Maybe was it's hilarious. just time I hang them up. I got one word for you. Retirement. If you retire now, you're going to be walking on soft sand in a week. Just come to Florida and feel the wind in your hair. Retirement is like winning another one. Maybe I'll even join you. On a spotty network, this is what Tom heard. If you retire now, you're soft and weak. Just come to Florida and win another one. Maybe I'll even join you. Just go win another one. I hear this. I'm like, bro, this is low key a good commercial based off of the bad connection uh, concept behind it. That's kind of said easy, Kronk. Maybe it is. I still feel like I have a lot to accomplish. My goal is to win one more. And Gronk's coming with me. I'm retired from retiring? Mom! Where are my football pants? Don't trust big decisions to just the any way network. It, it end it was okay, but I definitely like that whole bad connection part of it. And I'm not softer weak either. <laughs> T-Mobile is the leader in 5G. 33, 34, John 35. Cena? Hi, I'm John Cena, and I know how to count. In fact, <laughs> knowing how to count could change your life on Super Bowl Sunday. Like help you win one million dollars if you count all the bottles of delicious mountain dew major melon hold on i might have to try that bro that low key looked like a hit hey if anybody's tried that get down in the comments let your boy know i might i might try that our out. new watermelon flavor in our commercial <sighs> <I'm at> <laughs> this thing looked off <laughs> 
off a heavy dosage of drugs, my nigga. But imagine that the watermelon one is the same exact, the same exact Mountain Dew, just with pink, pink food color. Seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. What's your cousin from Boston? I did not see that coming. Anyway, Sam Adams, Wicked Hazy IPA. Juicy, right? Can we not tell my mom about this? Nigga, she's gonna find out. Look, the whole town is re wreaking havoc. What are you talking about? So, are you gonna buy the car? Please, if I could just go home and discuss things with my wife. I've been here all weekend. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't never been in no dealership to actually, well, I've been in one, like, when my parents was purchasing one and all that, but this is hilarious. That probably was if I could just go home and talk it over with my wife. Them salesmen know that means you are not coming back half the time. You leave any time you want. <laughs> that was a dope transition. Well, that was painless. Go to Vroom.com, buy a car, and we'll deliver it contact-free. Baby, hi. We're so glad you're here. The Welcome first part of that one was pretty fun. Home to 8 billion humans who were also once babies. Is Even this a new show? Right now, you only need to know two of them. And together, you make a family. These are also families. Neat, huh? Now, you're kind of a big deal around here. Watch this. Do anything right now. That baby is called Control. Enjoy it. Oh, and this? Oh, yeah. That won't fly when you're older, kid. And exactly. you get to have your favorite <laughs> meal whenever you're, well, hungry. You go through a phase where you think... Look at this. What the heck? What is, what is this contraption? Whenever you well... I've seen people do the bread. What the heck? Hungry. You go through a phase where you think everything is edible. Most of it isn't. But sometimes... You can That's literally true. sleep whenever you want. Or not. Oh, so Dan's head isn't on upside down. That's just a beard. <laughs> yep, being a baby is pretty great. Everyone is always thrilled to see you. Well, almost everyone. You can go. Like, go whenever nature calls. That's where we come in. We're huggies. Hi. We make these, and these, and other stuff to help your parents keep you comfy. Look at the one at the bottom. The baby straight sitting on this man's head. these, is. and these, and other stuff to help. <laughs> the one at the bottom, it should be. Y'all see it. The baby, the, the diaper sitting right on this man's head, bro. I'm weak. Help your parents keep you comfy. So you have time for something important, like finding your foot. Go easy, kid. Whoa, where'd he go? See, the thing is, baby, it's a crazy world, but you'll grow to love it. Well, most of it anyway. Get some rest now, kiddo. We'll be here when you wake up, which should be right about... As soon as he sat down to relax. That's, that's, we got you, baby. This is actually a pretty good one, too. I kind of I kind of like that one. Come on. Man, me and Pizza Hut went way back. I've been playing this game since 82. You ever think Pac-Man gets tired of eating these same little dots? Mm. Mm. I mean, who eats dots anyway? I need a And I can't think of his name, but he was in Hot Tub Time Machine. A couple, I think one or two other movies. He had a little series on uh, Hulu, too. And, of course, he was in um, The Office for a couple okay. seasons. I can get any three toppings on my large pizza for just 10 bucks. Pepperoni, sausage, bacon, run, little man, run! That's what I would do. Go! Hey, Pizza Hut, we just did a reaction to, a, or not a reaction, a food r review to their Detroit style pizza. If y'all haven't seen it, bro, be sure to check that out. That mess was hidden. Taste maker, only from Pizza Hut. I think I'm about to out Pizza the Hut. No, no, no one out Pizza the Hut. Twas the night before. Hold up. Let's take this up a notch. It was the night before Super Bowl and all through Tampa Bay. I'm about to say, ain't this an old commercial? Ready to play. When what to my wondering eyes should appear, but the Super Bowl legends of yesteryear. 
You still warming up? Eli and Peyton, they're up throwing footballs, snacking on legs and destroying them walls. How the hell y'all beaming football? Hey, what are you doing? His idea, Dad. He he hey, 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 I don't care. Be stuff on that's they, that's they dad, uh, Archie, man, and right play for the Saints. Hey, what are you doing? My boy, let's go. Y'all already know I'm a Saints fan. Man. His idea, Dad. He he hey, hey, I don't care. Be stuff on them boys, aren't you? Go to bed. Thanks a lot. Catch the ball. Don't be scared of the ball. I was not scared of the ball. Montana you 15 and balls and a rock and door. Paul. Adding Doritos to the Super Bowl store. Hey, you. hey guys. Aitman. Can I play? Who was that? Jerry Rice, Troy Aikman. Who's the other guy? I can't think of his name, bro. Is that the 49ers? Um... Old quarterback. I cannot think of his name, bro. That's tough. Dan Marino? Is that Brought him? some chips. Hell no. <laughs> hey, we're going to take these Doritos, well, though. Come on, man. Get you, get you we didn't play you guys in the Super Bowl. That's my shot, Joe. Come, come on. on, we're friends. Joe? Oh, you guys are unbelievable. Bro, y'all got to let me know who that is. I can't. I don't know who that is. I've seen him before. It's called the Immaculate Reception. Oh, it was the Immaculate Pass. It was below the man's ankle. Easy catch. You couldn't make that catch. Hey, Brash on Bettis caused a snack table to shatter. You gotta go. Oh, you gotta go. I told you it wasn't that easy. I told you. Not just. Away to the yeah. window, Dion ran in a flash. He tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. Kickoff is coming. The teams are ready. Both hope that their season will end in confetti. So get the Doritos. You guys are all right. Then get the Tostitos, pour salsa, pour queso, get the Lay's and the Cheetos. Now snack away, snack away, snack away, y'all, because Super Bowl's here and we about to ball. So happy Super Bowl to all and to all a good night. And don't forget the chips. That was cool. Did you know that they had Norway a lot of sells way more electric cars per capita than the U.S.? Norway. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Will Ferrell in this bit. You know he got to start this from the rip. Ball. So happy um, Super Bowl to all and to all I a good I think it's night. for that Cadillac and commercial. Don't I, I want to say I saw a piece of this one. Did you know that Norway sells way more electric cars per capita than the U.S.? Norway. <laughs> what is that fact? Well, I won't stand for it. Never mind. With GM's new Ultium battery, we're gonna crush those losers. Oh, this is electric. Crush huh? them! Let's Bro, this mess looks clean. I ain't gonna lie to you. It looked futuristic as hell, but this mess looks like look at the windshield on there with like all that messages. That mess look clean, especially the the uh grill on it. Go America. Keenan, Norway's out EVing us. Wait, what's this? Oh, it's my daughter's birthday. She's really a pirate. I don't lately. care. Grab an EV, meet me in Norway. Okay, can I say goodbye to my family? Nope. All right. Pretty dumb. First of all, what does that mean, meet me in Norway? Nigga, are you paying for this plane ticket or what do we. <laughs> I mean, what the heck are we talking about? Am I riding with you? <clears throat> Aquafina, sorry to disturb you, but Norway's beating us at EVs. Nuh uh. Uh huh. Nuh uh. Uh huh. Cow. Meet me there in an hour. <laughs> can I ride with you? No. GM's Ultium battery is made for all types of vehicles, so soon everyone can drive an EV. You gonna get Whoa. there in an hour on this slow Why ass? We all just go together. Ain't no no one way. Is probably flying private. <laughs> How did you get out of the car and out of the crate? Hey, Norway, listen up, you fish loving. Oh, this place is adorable. Damn it! Where are you guys? We in Finland. Where are you? I'm in Norway. Norway? You're in Sweden. Oh, damn it! <laughs> Thirty new EV, bro. This that damn truck is it's clean. Just... Though. I ain't gonna lie. That was probably one of my favorite ones so far. Just because Will Ferrell was in it. He's he's pure comedy. Flawless, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I literally couldn't imagine a more beautiful vessel for Alexa to be. This was the one I seen. Hold on, bruh. Because this was pretty funny, too. Alexa to be flawless, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I literally couldn't imagine a more beautiful vessel for Alexa to be inside. Alexa, how many tablespoons are in a cup? There are 16 tablespoons in a cup. Babe, food just got here. Why are you cooking? 
this is the one, coach. This might be my favorite. You feel me? This is pure comedy to me. Pure comedy. Everybody said, food's here. Why, why are you cooking? Like, you got bigger issues, buddy. In a cup. There are 16 tablespoons in a cup. Babe, food just got here. Why are you cooking? <laughs> Who's that? Alexa. Turn on the sprinklers. Honey, I already ran the sprinklers. Things are getting way too wet around here. Oh. <laughs> Things are definitely getting wet, my boy. And it ain't... <laughs> It ain't just the grass, my nigga. It ain't just the front lawn, my boy. What you mean? She, <laughs> these niggas are clowns. The fact this was an Amazon commercial was hilarious. Alexa, dim the lights. <laughs> dim the lights, like I take my shit off. And I, all right, my nigga, relax, relax. Alexa, lights up. Alexa, lights up. <laughs> So you might as well go ahead and file for that divorce, my boy. Add bath oil to my shopping list. Alexa, no, don't do that. Read my audio book. I was in his hands. What is he, bruh? Book. I was in his Alexa, lights up! Add bath oil to my shopping list. Alexa, no, don't do that. Read my audio book. I was in his hands. I was being changed. Yeah. Lady, you need counseling. <laughs> If you just did all this, <laughs> this lady needs help. But I was also kissing him. Honey, other people have to use the bathroom around here too. Nigga, that is the least of your concerns. Your wife is, you know what? Like, if you Lately, <laughs> I just, I haven't been feeling quite like myself. Life used to feel. Fuller. I want to break free. Matthew? I want Some days are harder than others. I want to break free for you. It's like I used to be solid ground. Welcome, Matthew. Look at my head. That's the girl from the try? office, too. Or did you project. travel by fax? I want to break free. There's got to be a way to get back. This is kind of cool just because of the concept of him being flat and then you eat the 3D chips and it brings you back to life kind of thing. Those, the way that these look though, kind of remind me of like a, a like bugle or something. Have y'all ever had those bugles? I want to break free. That'd be a little like a daggone chicken nugget. Do y'all see this at the bottom? Do not attempt if you're a 3D person. Wait, what? That low key look like a chicken nugget though. Doritos, now in 3D. Thank you guys so much for watching this video of the funniest Super Bowl commercial. All right, bro, we out of here, you feel me? Where we at? Hold on. Let me get back to it, get y'all right. All right, bro, I thought I wasn't recording. I was about to be sick, but either way, as y'all can see, that was um our reaction to all the funniest Super Bowl commercials. You feel me? It was it was cool. You feel me? I feel like maybe only four to five of those really hit for me. Um, the one with Will Ferrell for sure. The one with Michael B. Jordan got to be the funniest though. That's probably the funniest one to me, bro. That's pure comedy. But either way, man, it is what it is. Y'all get down there in the comments. It's probably like a 30 minute video. Y'all get down there in the comments. Let me know which one y'all was rocking with. Which one was y'all favorite from the Super Bowl? Um, I'm not sure if this was every single one, but Y'all let me know, bro. You feel me? Y'all get down there in the comments. Y'all y'all let me know which ones y'all was rocking with. Um, and if they missed any that y'all want me to check out or if it's a, a like better video for this, just get down there in the comments and let your boy know. I'll definitely try and check it out. Um, but, hey, man, I ain't really got too much else to say. You feel me? Here's what it is. This year's commercials wasn't. That was like 30 commercials. You feel me? Only four to five of them really hit for me. Oh, really like four hit for me. You feel me? I don't know. A little bit lackluster if you ask me, but either way, bro. We just hit 15K subscribers not too long ago. 
a couple days ago. Appreciate all the love y'all been showing, but you already know we on the road to 20K. You feel me? Let's keep it going. Keep it growing. And like I always say, y'all keep coming back, tuning in. I'm going to keep these videos rolling out. We're going to keep getting it lit over here. Catch y'all in the next video.